Hello guys, so in this video I'll be showing you how to create a .plp file with Pixelab and why is it important you, you do this? Um, first of all, you don't have to um, use just one phone, uh, you don't have to limit yourself to using just one phone and I'll explain that um, um, quickly. So um, there was a time when I wanted to create a design and my phone was going to go off and I had to deliver this work. So what I did was that um, I created a .plp file. Of, I was already designing with this my phone and then I had to create a .plp file and then um, send it to another phone and continue working with that other phone and I was able to deliver the work you see so um, if I I didn't have to start from scratch so that's the whole point and then um, you can also use it um, to save your work so that um, when you back up maybe you you um, for any reason you change your phone you don't have to lose all your projects or your designs you can quickly um, you can simply um, bring them back um, save them again yeah and I'll be showing you just that another reason is that um, for you can use it to sell um, to sell um, as as you can use it as a way of selling templates to clients or people i mean people that have like, like they want to be creating designs for their brands but they don't know how to design you can create a template and then send it as a dot plp file of course sell it to them and you know teach them how to use the dot plp file just as i'll be showing you here and that way you are making money with it all you do is you come here you come here and then you click on it you can as well use this place here you can as well use this place so you click on here and then you go to open.plp so project file. you want to create a .plp file of what you do is that you see if you look carefully you're going to see this send transfer button so you're just going to click on it and it's going to show saved so this it, it, it's it, it's it's now saved in your um in your file manager so what you do now Maybe um, I'm going to show you how to open it now. So this is, just assume that this is another phone. You get the gist, right? So you are going to click on this same place. The same place. Either you come to this open.plp file like I just showed you. Or you come here. Or you come here. So you click on it. And then you go to this place here. You are going to see this .plp file. This one. And then you click on it. So you are just going to go to um you you're going to navigate using this place to to your pixel app folder so i'm just going to do that quickly so as you can see this is pixel app folder so i'm just going to click on it and then i'll scroll i'm going to see it we got it here so this is the dot plp file so i'm just going to click on it and you're going to see um do you want to add it do you want to add it to your project as well? If you want to add it to your project, you press open and add. So it's going to add it. That, that means save it as a project. But if you just want to open it, then you want to save it later. You use the first one. This open here. So anyone works. So I'm going to click open only because I've already, I have already have it saved already. You get? So you, if you have opened a project before, it's going to show this. But if you have not opened any project, it won't show this. So you just press OK. You see, we have opened that. I've opened the project too. Pretty easy. So this is how you create a .plp file. So um, you can create a .plp file and then save it maybe in your drive just in case you change your phone or you send it, you know, save it in your um, SD card. Um, so that's just pretty. I hope you find this helpful. So subscribe if you haven't and can leave a thumbs up.